kill anyone who gets in our way. No. Not kill anyone. Kill a few people. Kill no people. Kill one guy, one stupid guy who no one loves. And Chris Pratt and his gang of lovable Marvel misfits are back in Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, previously digital, gets released on disc today. 4K, Blu-ray, DVD, extras, the whole shebang. And then tomorrow, it starts streaming on Disney+. Plus. One last ride with these very fun characters. Irreverent, zappy, weirdly emotional. I really liked it. Don't these people have jobs? They got their money in the stock market, not in mayonnaise jars buried in their backyard. <laughs> and also now on Disc and Digital, comedian Sebastian Maniscalco's comedy with Robert De Niro about my father, in which he's mortified to introduce his future in-laws to his old school Sicilian pops. Is Maggie 1 a mistake for Maggie 2, or is Maggie 2 to cover for Maggie 1? Also John Hamm and Tina Fey in Maggie Morbs. A comic murder mystery directed by Ham's Mad Men buddy, John Slattery. Shall be fine. Just one night. Hello? Also new horror, Malum, a remake about a rookie cop haunted by scary stuff on the night shift. The internet has a lot of great tips about how to exercise demons. Yeah. And Sorry About the Demon, a horror comedy about a possessed ex. You're our last best chance to break through. Then a new World War II movie, Assault on Hill 400, with Michael Madsen, William Baldwin, and Eric Roberts. We should load up. It's time to float. And wait, what? The River Wild? Yeah, they went and remade the Meryl Streep thriller from the 90s about a whitewater rafting family hijacked by killers. This one starring Leighton Meester, Adam Brody, and SNL vet Taryn Killam. You can also see it today on Netflix. How could I possibly be expected to handle school on a day like this? Bueller. Hey, then in the classics, Ferris Bueller's Day Off upgrades to 4K today. So does Clive Barker's Nightbreed, the great Bill Paxton thriller One False Move. East of Eden with James Dean and Rio Bravo with John Wayne. I'm going to be famous when I solve this case and become a big hero. All right, then we go digital where new movies on demand include Susie Searches, Kiersey Clemens as a young detective with a dark secret with Jim Gaffigan. My daughter, where is she? Also Shrapnel, Jason Patrick out to rescue his kidnapped daughter from a cartel. Your children need stability and at the moment we haven't seen enough. What more do you need to see? And some gritty acclaimed indies, Earth Mama about a single mom struggling to keep her family together. And War Pony, a coming of age movie set on an Indian reservation, co-directed by actress Riley Keough. They suppressed our memories, but I can still feel something following us. Oh, and also the horror sequel Insidious the Red Door comes home on premium VOD today, straight from theaters. We were the two biggest people on YouTube, and it became a thing to hate Jake Paul. All right, then to check in on streaming, Netflix today drops a documentary about influencer boxer Jake Paul, Problem Child, also that River Wild remake that I mentioned earlier. I'm Sheila D. Rubin. Let's move. And then looking ahead, tomorrow, Apple starts a new season of their show, Physical, and as mentioned, Guardians of the Galaxy 3 hits Disney+. Plus. Then Thursday is when Peacock adds the Super Mario Brothers movie, also when the Shark sequel Meg 2 hits theaters. So does, well, actually today is when the new animated Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie starts playing in theaters. A look at those and more next time I see you, Friday, on the next Director's Chair.